Scarlet, follow that. Crikey. <laughs> what does Labour? She's, she's well, just talked about a good where game. Where do you start? I mean, I, I mean, Suzanne says I wouldn't trust I wouldn't trust Labour after the last Tory administration only a few days ago completely crashed the economy. Right. So let's look at what Rishi Sunak and, and uh, Keir Starmer are doing. I mean, one of the things that that is, was absolutely essential uh, to keep to keep the economy going, to keep people from 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 not being able to uh, heat their homes was a cap uh, on 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 the uh, on, on the oil, um, electricity and gas prices. Um, which was opposed by Rishi Sunak and Liz Truss and is now in. I mean, the problem with 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 uh, Labour is because they're in opposition, they can only put up ideas, right? Um, the other idea which they put up, which again took a very long time to get in, was was the windfall tax, which which Rishi Sunak has put in tweaked. So actually, Shell, who makes billions and billions of extra profits because of what's going on doesn't pay any of the windfall tax at all, even though the CEO actually believes that they should be doing it. So those are two of the things that are happening now. Now, what we've got to do is we've got to look at the choices that people have got to make, because because actually, what 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 sort of country do we want? And again, you look at what the Labour Party want, and what they're saying is, we think that people who are foreigners and work in Britain should be should pay in Britain. So we're going to get rid of the non of the non dom, so that they don't just only pay thirty thousand pounds in tax; they pay their tax properly, uh, which will get an awful lot, and and that money will go into breakfast clubs, right? So that all children in all schools can have breakfast. Because what we know at the moment is we've got a cost of living crisis. We want to get children into schools, which is very good for them. And we want to get them eating. I mean, the other thing is to take, uh, one of the other ideas is to take, um, <clears throat> to stop having private schools allowed not to pay VAT on school fees. And that money would go straight into uh, into making state schools better. So actually, not only as whenever the Labour Party puts anything up, is it costed, funded, but actually it's about choices let, and let it's me, about whose side do you want. Because what you just said there, you said the Labour Party always cost and, uh, and it, they fund it and everything. Let's bring Suzanne in on this as well. Let's bring Suzanne. And uh, Suzanne, I want you to respond uh, to that because she's basically mm. said the Labour Party, Scarlett said the Labour Party always cost everything. Well, this is what I was saying earlier about it being politically driven. I think this, from, from what we've just heard, that's not so much economic policy as a class war, to be honest. Let's, uh, let's, let's attack people that send their children to public schools. Mm. Let's attack businesses that actually are profitable and, and make money. Um, let's attack people who pay tax overseas, but actually spend an awful lot of money and pay VAT on the goods that they buy in Britain. So I think this, this actually kind of shows I was right about what I was saying earlier. Let's just break those things down. So the windfall tax, um, I was quite disappointed to see the Conservatives bring that in, actually. Shell has been mentioned, obviously a big oil giant that has, yes, is making excessive profits, arguably, at, the, at this current time. But for many years, they didn't make any profit. And they're not paying any windfall taxes now because of the conditions put on by the Conservative government that, that they had to invest in new infrastructure. And that's why Shell is, is avoiding taxes. They're not avoiding taxes because they're somehow evil. They're avoiding taxes because they're actually investing in energy, which are, has, has got to be the thing to do at this particular time. And let's not also forget that Shell is now a wholly British company as opposed to an Anglo-Dutch company that it was last year. And the reason it's now British and put its headquarters solely in Britain is because the Dutch government was basically behaving in a way that was not encouraging it to invest. Uh, there were big court cases against Shell that it felt were disadvantageous to it. I mean, it and could be. Move to I was going to say, and if the Labour be, Party gets it, in, this is what we're going to see happen. Countries well, potentially, but it could be that, that Shell got very favourable bills. I hear they haven't really paid that much tax. Uh, Scarlett, your your view on, on what's been said there. Um, uh, Look, I, mean, I, I, I didn't actually that. say it's Shell was tax. evil. What I what I said was the windfall tax was tweaked so that Shell didn't have to pay it. And and that's the problem is it's not. I mean, when you have the CEO of Shell yesterday saying that they should be paying tax, they should be protecting the vulnerable. Right. 
and and they're not paying tax, then something is wrong. And that that that's they what we've got to do. Is we've, we've they're just to... not paying the windfall tax. Let's be clear. They're not Shell paying the windfall tax. tax. The windfall tax was actually it's about excessive profits. They know they're making excessive profits, right? They're making excessive profits not because they're running Shell well, but because. Because because there's what's happening in the rest of the world, they understand it. The CEO expects to pay it, but actually the win the windfall tax has been tweaked so that they aren't paying. It's not about Shell, actually. It's about whether we're serious about about trying to make up for taxes in this way. I mean, what we've got to do is there is a black hole, right? And we, we, either we, we, we know, you know we, know, we, we have we to know. do something about tax, got or it. we have to do something about public services.